I think the two big themes that we're going to see a ton of press around and lots of product around are going to be around connected living room um, and mobile. It's tablets, new smartphones, um, but I think where the real innovation is going to be uh, in terms of seeing some interesting new products is going to be in around home automation. Um, I think recently we've seen a ton of buzz with Nest thermostats, you know, selling out and so forth for the holiday season, but um, some of that automation, but also in-car entertainment. Um, I think these are some areas where we'll start to see some really interesting uh, product demonstrations. But the things I think that'll get a lot of press are, you know, large OLED uh, televisions um, and, you know, the latest tablets. But I think the fact of the matter is those two segments are gonna be an evolution of where we are today. So in uh, 2012, I think the Consumer Electronics Show, uh, it's more of a tweener year. In 2011, there was a lot of excitement around smartphones, around tablets, the rise of Android, even some 3D TV push still. Um, and I think as, as we get to the 2013 CES, that's going to be real exciting too. And as we get to the latter half of 2012, Ultrabooks will be making a big push. There'll be a lot of innovation in the PC market. So uh, I think, again, the odd number of years are, are looking like they're the exciting ones, 2011 and uh, the next one, 2013. There'll be a lot to see and talk about. I think tablets are still going to be, without a doubt, you know, a big uh, product category at CES, no doubt about it. But the difference this year is there's going to be a lot of attention around not just Ultrabooks, but Win8. Um, and I think when we think about Win8, whether it's on PC form factors or Win8 tablets, um, I think that's going to be a huge buzz category. And I think when you take a look at what Ultrabooks will be at CES, um, it's going to demonstrate that the PC can actually be uh, an aspirational product versus just another PC with a new OS on it. The thing I'm going to be looking for at CES, the thing that I hope to find, is some great new user interfaces. And what I mean by that is we're talking plenty about voice because of things like Siri. We're talking a lot about gesture because of things like Connect. But I want to see where is UI and UX going? Where are these user experiences going? Um, are we going to see voice integration with remotes? Are we going to see um, gesture starting to come into the experience? And then more specifically, how's the visual interface going to evolve, in particular with connected TVs? And to me, that's where we need to see some significant innovation, what I'd be really excited and be looking for at the show.